What's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today I've got another Fallout 4 Creation Club featured page video to talk about. This time actually possibly being the smallest update we have ever gotten, you know, to the featured page in quite a while. They literally like didn't add anything and they removed a lot of stuff. I mean the VR workshops for once in ages is not here, which is like absolutely crazy that I think that all the new content that Bethesda have recently just put out in the last couple of months have all finally been taken off the feature page. And yeah, it looks like they're starting to advertise a couple other things here and there. And yeah, actually really not too many as, believe it or not, we've got a couple of free skins again this week. And yeah, they're not really advertising too much, you know, stuff that is actually selling for big credits. We do have the real estate uh, module uh, bundle, sorry, for says... For limited time only, this bundle includes three creations, including Nuka uh, Collector, Charlestown Condo, Noir Penthouse. Together are uh, worth 1,400 credits. And yeah, again, it is uh, discounted, I do believe. But yeah, I actually do own this. I don't remember even... Oh, no, never mind. I don't own this. It just... Wait, what? I have no idea why it keeps changing. I'm pretty sure I don't own the bundle. I remember buying them like separately. But yeah, it looks like it's 1,000 credits that I just got seen then, which is 400 credits off, and yeah, again, I don't know, I'm pretty sure I own all three of them, but I don't remember if I actually bought the bundle, so I don't know if it necessarily, you know, does it like that, but who knows, it actually might, it also has the Unstoppables Pip-Boy bundle, which I don't remember seeing this in quite a while, if not ever, I don't really remember, but it says, your fear for the dramatic, it can't be stopped, now you can tackle the Commonwealth like a true vanquisher of evil, with the collection of the Unstoppable Pip-Boy paint jobs, all of your favourite heroes are included, Grognak the Barbarian, Mistress of Mystery, the Inspector, Manta Man, and the Silver Shroud, together are worth 500 credits, and yeah, they are down to 400 so again i don't ever remember them really adding this at all but yeah i know they have like separate ones like this one like the silver shroud one i know has obviously been there the grognak barbarian though i don't remember if they've ever added that i don't know if i think they're already on the um store although i just think they have added them you know into a bundle but again these skins could be new because i really don't remember them too much, but yeah, I think they have been there for quite a while, and yeah, the uh, Silver Shroud one, I know, has definitely been there for quite a while, but again, I don't really remember Manta Man, the Vanquisher, um, and yo, oh, the Mystery of, uh, the Mistress of Mystery, sorry, and the Inspector, and Manta Man, I don't really remember them ever being on here, Grognor the Barbarian might have been, Silver Shroud, I know, definitely was, but yeah, I don't really remember those three. Now we get into our free paint jobs. We've got the Power Armor Paint Job Purple. Show off a new paint job for your Power Armor creation is craftable at Power Armor Stations. So yeah, this is the purple one. Again, if you guys are on PS4, highly recommend you don't get these as it can cause a zero killer blight glitch. Which means pretty much it says that you can't save your game because you don't have enough storage left. When in reality, you most likely do. And yeah, it's just a big glitch. It says you got zero kilobytes um, remaining or something like that. So yeah, don't get it if you're on PS4. If you're on an Xbox, I heard it can be a little bit of an occasion. If you're on PC, you should be fine. But we've got the Power Armor Paint Job Yellow. Again, show off a new paint job for your Power Armor creation. This craft will out the Power Armor Station. So this one actually looks really, really cool. I might even hop on PC later and actually get this. This actually looks... Really, really nice. Um, yeah, nice and bright. You don't oftenly see it. If there was a pink one, I'd probably get it too. But yeah, pink and yellow, two bright colors, I guess, that you can run around the Commonwealth with. Not bad, but says so. And then we got the Power Armor Paint Job Green, which says, yeah, again, show off a new paint job for your Power Armor creation is craftable at the Power Armor Stations. Some reason it's not loading, but yeah, green again. This is a little bit of a darker green rather than lighter green, I would say. But yeah, this yellow one. Looks really, really cool. I'm not even too sure. I might even get this on PC again later. So yeah, that looks actually really nice. But anyone, to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for the latest Fallout content and Fallout news and Creation Club news and content. Don't forget to comment in the comment section down below. What are your thoughts and opinions on this week's update? Did you guys think it was a good update? Are you guys surprised they took off the VR workshops and all of the previous, uh, you know, um... Uh, content that they brought in the last couple of months. I definitely would really like to know your thoughts and opinions down below. And also don't forget to subscribe to my gaming channel and my IRO slash vlogging channels. Links for them, I mean not my gaming, sorry, my sports channel, sorry. Links for them are in the description down below. And yeah, go check out my podcast as well if you guys haven't already. Links for that is in the description down below as well. So as I was saying, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe and comment and I'll see you guys next time.